Hey guys. No, no, no. They're not guys. You're my peeps. They're my peeps. My peepers. Peepers. They're not guys. Guys. Peeps. Hey peeps. Where are we going? Farm gate. Farm gate. Yes, we're going to farm gate. Okay, hon, we are here at farm gate. And we were here last year at the very end of the season and they had um not a lot <laughs> not, it's like nothing everything was empty <laughs> but we did get a quick tour and we said when spring comes we need to come back and here we are beautiful oh yeah i love when they actually have a little presentation for you this place is pretty big Ooh, japanese maple lots of canna lilies eh? Fountains. We do love the canna. What's that? We do love the canna. Look yes. at these. Those planters are gigantic. The hydrangea trees in them. I love the yes. And it's oh, it's, you can even buy it. It does look. It's a, a resiny material. I don't know where to go. There's so much. There's some collocations. Let's come down since we're tropical plant people. And look at that, there we go. I believe to be collocasias. I saw them from far away, but yes, so collocasias. And these for us have enjoyed wet, 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 constantly soaking wet. Madagascar palms. Okay, so this is... Because for some reason I really love things with spikes. Yeah. I don't get enough things Actually, poking me when I'm playing in the plant. That might be something you need to purchase. Because uh, yeah. in three or four years that thing is going to look spectacular. I just love the aeroid style leaf. I just look at it. Outside, you can see they know it's very, very moist, wet. Yeah. Okay. And I'm gonna come over, let's check out. We're not gonna do too much in annuals, but you can look, this is like a, Jap a Japanese maple that's been planted. It's huge. Look at this. They will not survive our seasons outside. Yes. This is beautiful. Yeah. Oh, I see what's going on here. Look, they've got a little, Oh, okay. See, this was empty last year. This was just like a barn. But you can see, like we came in the fall, like late fall. <laughs> I love this pot. Yes. Okay, that's a good pot. I gotta give that to you. That's a good pot. It's the Rusty's reading pot. I don't need glasses. I just wear them because I look smarter. Beautiful orchid. You love orchids, eh? I really do. This guy's actually, yeah, he's wet. Maybe he's too wet. He's crispy. Oh, there's another guy with your glasses. Oh, he's so cute. Yeah. That's why I wear them, honey. Get it. Okay, so. Oh yes, the rain, the water goes down, follows the chain, ends up on the ground. Pretty cool. Lavender trees and lilacs. Oh, were they? <laughs> I think I did, but that's not what I meant. <laughs> ah, this is like a living, like a living wall. This is when you know that you've successfully planted your vineage. <laughs> <laughs> it's amazing. It's natural. That's when nature is, it looks like nature is one. We built a concrete wall we, and we're taking over nature and then it came back and kicked your ass. Mealy magnets. <gasps> oh. Yeah, this is pretty good. Yeah. Oh, yeah. concrete. Yeah. It's like, it reminds me of, um, Groot. This. It's the Groot table set. With the beautiful in the garden. It is spectacular though. It's stunning. I love it. Okay, so I, we need to go and sell something. <laughs> oh, 
That's a beautiful section of Japanese maples. Look at them. Like how oh. mature. See them? That big red section. Them, yeah. We're gonna come. We're gonna come back to that. We have none of this was here last year. It became so late. It was. It was the end of the season. Yes, everything was gone. This was empty. And I don't wanna bore you with all the annuals that you're gonna see every day. I love grasses, so we will talk about some grasses. We got the blue grass. Very nice. Eighteen dollars Canadian. Ah, the Semper Vivum. Whole entire collection. And these are good. You just got to be careful. Some of them, um, their zone is a lot different. Like we're a zone four or five where we are. And some of them, um, they go down to zone two. Some of them are zones like five, six. You got to be careful. And, they, and we find they like growing in a, like a rocky area. They are beautiful. Oh, and this is the golden nugget. This was a, used to be a rare Semper Vivum. It's very tough to find, the golden nugget. Some beautiful Semper Vivums. I, have you found any of the colorful... Um, oh, look at these big boys. And, oh my gosh. I think some of them got blown away. Gnome? Gnomage? Gnomage, hon? Huh? It is a gnome. Hostage. Lots of hosta. Hosta la vista. They're beautiful. So these mushrooms are pretty cool. $158. That's a pretty good price for a mushroom. I like the design. Yes. Yeah, they're very, very nice. Okay, so lots of nice little trees. I did see some those bonsai style. Artwork trees. Yes. I love artwork. Now we have them and we just, we, we seem to like them. We just don't do the <laughs> cutting. Okay, just before we go any further, I'm just going to show you because we're not going to go down there. Tons of trees there. Tons of trees back in there. Bushes, shrubs, more here. And then miles back there. You can see they've overwintered these. So this is, that's, they, they've grown them over the, over the winter here. So we've got all that. And here they are. Beautiful. Beautiful. I can't wait to get over to those Japanese maples. Although I fear that they're gonna be out of our price league, but they're stunning nonetheless. Now if you do see any um, golden smoke bushes, <laughs> let me know. Uh, I, I've got to, I've got to take a beeline as Nelly goes over there. I've got to take a beeline to these because look at that one Japanese maple. It's it's like it's you can buy them. They're in baskets. Now I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared. Okay, over here. Five oh seven. Okay. Japanese maple. Zone five, so they're right at our our zonage. Zone five, and what's the price? This is going to be oh, what? It's only four hundred dollars. That's actually it, shoot, that's a little cheap, isn't it? Four forty-two. It's like wow. Hmm. Like that's yeah, an instant changes your garden. Just poof. It's like whoa. Instantly. Your garden is like ready to rock. Nelly is 
Oh, there's some more. These are the more expensive ones, the very fine Japanese maple leaf leaves. And that's kind of neat. And I see some sumacs. Well, we do like the tiger eye sumac. I'm not sure what this one is. Oh, tiger's eye. So what is the tiger's eye sumac? They are actually a great plant. How much are they? <laughs> they might buy one. 70 bucks. Nelly. Where's my Nelly? Nelly? Nelly, where are you? Those big, look, those big red ones? Yes. How much do you think? The small ones were 509. Those little ones on this side with the finer leaf. How much do you think the big ones are? Eight something. 400 bucks. That's it? Yes. Really? I, I did the same thing. I was like, ooh, can I have three, please? Other than we don't have any room. Oh, we're doing the walk of shame, honey. The walk. Not a walk of shame. The walk. The walk of shame. Oh, if I had a million dollars. If I had a million dollars. I would buy me a tree. I would buy me a greenhouse. And if I had a million dollars. If I had a million dollars. I would buy me a blue spruce. But not a regular spruce. I would own all the plants. <laughs> It's like, look at that. Yeah, I'll take that. Red maple, please. Thank you. Yeah, could I have that to go? It's just unbelievable. I, I think we could walk around all day just walking around these. It's only really covered like a little section. Yeah. I do like these. Oh, there's that phone booth I like. These are pretty cool. We saw them at... Um, yeah, we saw them at Robert Plant. Serge de la Serge, Robert Plant Greenhouse. Four seventy-seven yep. ninety-nine. Yeah, so we'll probably got the same place. They're heavy. They're secure. They're like, I like ah. this one with all the leaves. And this is a, it looks like a Mother Nature. Yes, right. That's what I like about it. Yeah. Okay, for all your annual needs, visual enjoyment, they have it. I gotta say, they have it. And it's what a nice little place to stroll around. The ambiance is extremely nice. I'm not going to get in to show you all these. You're going to have to come down, folks. Ooh, a turtle. Honey, what are you doing? Buying another spiky plant because I don't stab myself with my plants enough. That's actually pretty cool. <laughs> I like it. Awesome sauce. Okay, as Nelly walks out proudly with her. I, I don't have one of these. Well, I didn't have one of these yet. Now very I Very proud. <laughs> Look at me. I have the best palm in the world. And these are actually pretty cool. Eh? Look, they're metal art, folks. So we're just on our way out. This is the last little section, but roosters, all metal. And then I noticed over here, too section of metal art. We need these. Okay, so let's wrap it up. What did you think about today's trip? Uh, it's absolutely beautiful here. If you have a chance, you've got to come check it out. Definitely um, at this time of year, not in the fall, when we came the first time. The gardens are just stunning. Everything is beautiful. Yeah, it's it's quite, It's you got to come. You got to check it out. It's excellent. So much stuff that I want that and, and won't a, fit in my car. Oh yeah, that would be cool. <laughs> Don't forget to like, subscribe, hit that notification bell, and see where we go next. Take care, guys.
with a perennial here, annual there. Here, a pit perennial, there, an annual. <laughs> perennial, annual, perennial, annual. Just let's go, stop it. Did you say island radio? That's what it was called. Island radio. I'm an island boy. Okay. I'm an island no, boy. <laughs> what did you say? I said I was playing with the GPS. Oh, the George St. Pierre? I would be GSP. Oh. I would be GSP. No. Mama. Ooh, I didn't mean to make you cry. If I was tomorrow, carry on, carry on. Nothing really matters. <laughs>